Uh, I'm just gonna take it. One, two, three. Welcome, folks. Welcome back to another Gun Minigun. And we have two miniguns. We have both my little brothers today, and as always, I'm going game. And today we are playing the Stanley Parable. Hi! One of my little brothers is a little nervous, but it should be fine, shouldn't you? You'd be okay, Brendan. <laughs> anyway, we're basically <coughs> doing this video, um, Stanley Parable. This is what about options. I've been wanting to do this a while. What's actually funny is if you look into the, um, Computer, um, you can see the Fraps logo. <laughs> well, of course you won't see it there, but you can actually see the um. Look. Yeah, yeah, you can see it. You can see, see it there as well. Can you see that? But yeah. Right. Yes. So we'll begin the game. So game. the end is never the end is never the end. end. So this is basically a game about options. You can get a lot of little things in, and from what I know, there's there's a Minecraft thing or something in here, which I know somebody's wanting. But we're gonna try random ones because. I think I know a few yeah. of the endings, but there's like so many endings. Could like we, I do one. Well, I'm going to be controlling it because it's, the controls in here are a bit sticky. Just tell me what decisions you're going to do. Okay. What are you doing? You know what I'm doing. We're recording a video. Ah, uh, remember, well, this is going to go on YouTube. Well, in a few weeks, I've got a stuff yeah. to. I've got a lot of stuff to edit actually. What well, it's taking a lot to load. I hate when this end is never the end. Is never the end. Is never the end. The end is loading. No, it's going to watch. The end is never the end. Is never the end. It's never the end. Come on. I hope it loads properly now. I hope it's not. Oh, God, my frames dropped. Is that good? No. That means it's going to lag. Lagging. Ah. You see that counter there? That's how many frames it's doing at the moment. It's got the frames have dropped. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. Uh, frames have gone up because I think One. it will be lagging too much. That's what happens if it lags on this. Two. two frames per second, my, that's not good. My old laptop, you know, the laptop downstairs that got broke. You mean the one I you, 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 you said you hadn't overused, but you had because the processor was black and burnt out? Yeah. Um. Ah, uh, what do you call it? When I was playing Happy Wheels with my mate at his house, literally, he was getting 12 fraps. And that, it's not they called, they're not called mad. 12 fraps, they're called, that's just a fraps counter, it's called frames per second. Frames, right? That, and you know what I would do? You know how much mine was? Yeah. 30, and mine were running smooth as always. You, got a bit, you had like a better lagging. processor, I told you this, you had a good processor. Yeah, I had two cores, didn't I? Yeah, you did. Alright, we're going up 16. I might get an ace a lot. Okay, here we go. Ah. Yeah. This is the story of a man named Stanley. Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number 427. Okay. Employee number 427's job was simple. He sat at his desk in room 427 and he pushed buttons on the keyboard. Orders came to him through a monitor on the desk, telling him what buttons to push, how long to push Oh wow, the old, in the old uh, command This insert. is what employee 427 did every day every month of every year. And although others might have considered it so winning, Stanley relished every moment that the orders came in, as though he had been made exactly for this job. And Stanley was happy. Frames are actually getting doing good now. And then one day something very peculiar happened. Something that would forever change Stanley. Something he would never quite forget. He had been at his desk for nearly an hour when he realized that not one single order had arrived on the monitor for him to follow. No one had showed up to give him instructions, call a meeting, or even say hi. Never in all his years at the company had this happened, this complete isolation. Something was very clearly wrong. Shocked, frozen solid, Stanley found himself unable to move for the longest time. But as he came to his wits and regained his senses, he got up from his desk and stepped out of his office. Right, here we go. So, sh I, hmm. How do we do this? You, oh, yo. Basically, you've got instructions. You know the guy who's talking. He tells you instructions sometimes. So. We're we going this way. No, there's some of the rooms that are locked. It changes all the time. What could it mean? Can we go into that? Well, Stanley decided listen. to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Should we go to the meeting room? Or uh, we... no! Alright, we'll go somewhere else. So, we'll try to start going to the meeting room and then we'll... What's this room? Trust me, I know what I'm doing. 
Got 20. I don't think I can get in there. No, I don't think I can get in there yet. Stanley went around touching every little thing in the office, but it didn't make a single difference. Nor did it advance the story in any way. I think the narrator's getting a little annoyed at us. Oh, I could oh, turn it off. I just turned it off. How did I do that? Can I, it, can I turn it back on? No, I can't turn it back on. Oh, jeez. Turn the computer off. I can't get into any of the doors. It, some, it changes all the time, really. Uh, what was the open? Where? No, behind you. A locker. A drawer. <gasps> We can't do it with it. Can we open it for you? No, we can't no. do it with it. Right, it's going to tell us to go somewhere in a minute, but I'm not going to go there. No, let's not go there. But we will go there after this one. Well, no, because it might take us all the way back. Oh, wait! When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. What do we do? Left or right? Left. You going to go left? What are you going to do? Uh, left. Alright, we're going left. We'll follow his instructions this time. And then not this time, but next time. Alright, we go. Um, I think there's a broom cupboard in here somewhere as well. If I remember rightly. Go into there. <gasps> it's dark. We're alright, it's not a horror game. There. Yet yeah, there was not a single person here either. Wait a minute. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Get the office, Chris out of the broom closet. Where's the broom closet? Get the... What the... The future is yesterday, tomorrow is now. Tomorrow I'll complete today's unfinished agenda items. Right next day's agenda. That's hey. creepy. Yeah, that, what the... Wait a minute. It's not a horror game, calm down! Do, do not, not alter, alter without... without... See if you can alter it. No, I can't alter oh, it. I can't alter it. Hmm. It's not creepy! Why are you so scared by everything? No, because I keep on seeing all the things change. Yeah, it's a game, it's gonna change. Uh, see, it's oh, gonna yeah. open the bro broom closet. Yeah, let's go in here. <gasps> Who's in there? Is it Chris? Where's Chris? Chris? Stanley stepped into the broom closet, but there was nothing here, so he turned around and got back on track. Um, no, I like this broom closet. Uh, maybe it's Chris. There was nothing here, no choice to make, no path to follow. Just an empty broom closet. No sure, I like broom closet. It's not even empty. It's got some stuff in, but you can't pick up. You can, you, okay. It was baffling that Stanley was still just sitting in the Will you shut closet. up? He wasn't right, even uh, doing anything. At least if there was something to interact with, he'd be justified in some way. As it that is, my he's cow? literally just standing he's annoying. doing sweet F.A. Okay, we're going to get out of here. I'm not, having, not gonna actually going to let you swear in front of my little brother there. Why did I actually swear? He said, he said an abbreviation for swear words. Why are you going back in? Are you, are you really still in the broom closet? Standing around doing nothing? Why? Please offer me some explanation here. I'm, I'm genuinely confused. Don't like her. Let's go out. I don't have a thing for him. Don't go in Oh, you don't want me to go in, okay. Oh, 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 down our rope. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's No, downstairs. No, we're not going down. We're not listening to you. Can we open this door? Nice stuff. Why is everything locked in this building? Let's go downstairs. How do you get out of the building? Ooh. I don't know if you can. Can we open up? No, we can't touch the fire rolls. This one might be a portal a bit. From we did Paul though. Yeah. That's but Stanley just couldn't do it. Ooh, can he I consider the possibility of facing his boss, admitting he had left his post during work. Well, nobody's here. Is that a DeLorean? No, and, and oh, I wanted a DeLorean. Economy, why had he Are they taken really all cars? Yeah. yeah. Why is it in the, in the building? Crazy. And then something occurred to Stanley. Is it in the building? Maybe, I don't know. Maybe I am oh, oh, crazy. Well, no, no, we're not crazy. How dare you say that? Spilt coffee. Existence in a single moment for no reason at all. Spilt coffee. Okay. Logical sense. Oh, as Stanley pondered this, he began to make other strange observations. What For the? For example, 
Why we just came in here. What, what do you mean? Where's my feet? Where's my, where's my feet? This is my, where's my feet when I look down? This I've got no feet. Yeah, they are. Stanley is the guy who played. Got the Stanley is us. What the? I'm dreaming. Yeah, you are, this mate. This is all a dream. Oh, what a relief Stanley felt to have finally found an answer, an explanation. His co-workers weren't actually gone. He wasn't going to lose his job. He wasn't crazy after all. I don't know if I can. <laughs> Soon, I'll have to go back to my boring real-life job pushing buttons. I may as well enjoy this while I'm still lucid. So, we can't go upstairs now. And began to gently float above the ground. Whoa, 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 what the hell? We're floating above the ground. Through space on a magical star field, and it too appeared. It okay, this is getting creepier. And Stanley marveled that he had still not woken up. How was he remaining so lucid? And then perhaps the strangest question of them all entered Stanley's head. One he was amazed he hadn't asked himself sooner. Why is there a voice in my head dictating everything that I'm doing and thinking? Yeah. Now the voice was describing itself being considered by Stanley, who found it particularly strange. I don't think I'm lost. You are. Thinking about how it's describing Will you just shut up and let us out of here, dude? And when he thought it all very odd, I wondered if this voice spoke to all people. We should have gone upstairs, shouldn't we? Yeah, this is one ending. This was not There's hundreds of different endings. Could it be? This was is just one. Simply deceiving himself, it's believing that if he's asleep, he doesn't have to take responsibility. Don't worry, we're gonna, have, we're gonna, have, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna reset in a minute. Right now, as he's ever when been in his life, it'll reset in a minute, guys. Anyway, reset. I'll reset one minute. One. He for certain, beyond a doubt, that this was in fact a dream. This is the most boring ending. To make the magical stars just a moment ago. How else would the voice explain all that? This voice was a part of himself too. Surely, surely, if he could just. He would prove it. He would prove that he was in control. That this was a dream. So he closed his eyes gently. All right. And he invited himself to wake up. He felt the cool weight of the blanket on his skin, the press of the mattress on his back. This the is the worst ending, I think, because I really shouldn't have done this one first, it's really creepy. Let me wake up, he thought to himself. I'm through with this dream. I wish it to be over. Let me go back to my job. Let me continue pushing the buttons. Please, it's all I want. I want my apartment, and my wife, and my job. All I want is my life exactly the way it's always okay, been. Okay, come on. My Wake. life is normal. I am normal. Wake up. Everything will be fine. Wake up. I am okay. Wake up, Stanley. Yeah, everything's not fine. I wish I had started this Stanley ending. I remember what happened in this ending. Please, now. someone, wake me up. My name is Stanley. I have a boss. I have an office. I am real. Oh, please, just someone tell me I, I am real. Done this I must be real. Yeah, it's not really nice. Can anyone hear my voice? Who am I? Who am I? And everything went black. I shouldn't have done this ending. This is a really bad one. This is probably the spookiest one of them all. Is it scary? This is the not exactly story. scary, but it's really creepy. Mariella woke up on a day like any other. She rose, got dressed, gathered her minute. belongings, and walked to her place of work. But on this particular day, her walk was yep. interrupted by the body of a man who had stumbled through town talking and screaming to himself, and then collapsed dead on the sidewalk. And although she would soon turn to go call for an ambulance, for just a few brief moments, she considered the strange... That's why I don't like this ending that much. obviously crazy. This much she knew. Is that Sam? Yeah. Is that his wife? No. That's Mary Ellen. Is he dead? I know what is For now. And what isn't. It was comforting to think this. And in a certain is that way, seeing this man that to me. better. Well, that's us. Then she remembered the meeting she had scheduled for that day. Very important people what? whose impressions are yeah, there's a car. Yeah, there's a car. The rest of her life. 
I've never noticed that I noticed like this ending. Well done for that. So it was only a moment that she stood there, staring why down that, at the body. Why was And then she turned why away. Why was that? Right. I don't know. Why that's that's now? one of the really bad endings. We're going to find some other ones now, though. Are we doing another one? Yeah, we're going to find some Can good go ones. Can I go for it? Can I go for it? No, I'm going to be controlling it. So what we do this time is we go for <coughs> the cupboard door. Good. But we got to keep going in the room cupboard as well, because the room cupboard gets locked up and everything later on. You shouldn't go in... No, no. You shouldn't go what? down that bit. Yeah, Reese, I know. See, we're back. Blah blah blah, shut up. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Let's go to meeting room. I'm going to the right room. No, we went to the meeting room. Just me. Yeah. Yeah, perhaps it did. When did. When did he. When did you die? I we, well we didn't die. That's what it is. The thing is, this game it screws you up. <sighs> yes, truly a room. There's like alive. so many endings in this game. This game really screws me ahead. I'm trying to. I've got to find it first. This is the Minecraft one. This is the start of the Minecraft one. Is this a scary game? Not exactly. No. This a Minecraft one. It's a little bit of a scary game. Stanley took the first open door on his left. No, nope, I'm not taking the first open door on my life, thank you very much. No. Nope. This is this hall bit. Directions. It's incredible he wasn't five years ago. Oh shut up. It's a little bit This is a portal room. You recognize the surroundings in portal kinda? Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've got enough on the road. No, we haven't. You're just annoying. I'm not your enemy, really. Yes, you are. You're not lost I now. I realize your trust in someone else can be difficult. You won't die now. Uh, uh, that the story is uh, nothing but uh, you. What? Really? No, I don't want to talk to you. I was in the middle of something. Do you have zero consideration for others? Yes, I do. Now leave me alone. I want something bad to happen to you. you? Yes, I do. I don't know how to convince you of this, but I really we do want to help you. We to can't. Show you something beautiful. Look, oh, let cool. me prove it. Let me prove right, we're going down some different stairs now. Give me a chance. Right, we do. Now, we got, we ignore some instructions that we have to get to the Give me a chance. No. Blue. We're going for the blue door. Aha. Perhaps you misunderstood. Stanley walked through the red no. door. No. I want to go for the blue door. I still don't think we're communicating properly. Stanley walked. All right, fine. Go ahead, Stanley. You want to know so badly what's out there? You want to find out what lies at the end of this road you've chosen? Well, don't let me stop you. Thank you. Now, this is where it gets kind of cool. You see? There's nothing here. I haven't even finished building this section of the map because you were never supposed to be here in the first place. Broken rooms, exposed developer textures. Is this what you wanted? Yes. Is it worth ruining the entire story out yes, it is. Yes, it is. For you? Do you not think I put a lot of time into that? No, I don't. I did. And in the end, it was all for nothing. Because this is what you wanted to see. Help me here, Stanley. Help elucidate these strange and unknowable desires of yours. What would have made this game better? A what different did game? you want to see? Vehicles? Skill yes. trees? Yeah. Work with me. You've given me absolutely nothing so far. Oh, shut up. Tell you what. Let me take a stab in the dark at a new design and you can give me some feedback. There we go. A third option. This already feels oh, like the head of where we were before. Red. Go ahead, Stanley. Take it for a spin. Well, I think this is how we get. Okay, I'm going to stop you there. Now, tell me about your experience with this new version. Would you say that the game benefited from allowing you more choices? Feel free to be honest. I'm looking for some real critical feedback here. A one? I mean, I can understand if you have reservations oh, wow. for some ways the game could be improved to more fully express itself mechanically and artistically, but a one? That's not even helpful. What am I supposed to do with that? Oh, but I guess it isn't my place to judge. What? What does Here, it say? based on the data from your one, previous playthrough, I compiled a new version. And to be perfectly candid, I think I've knocked it out of the park with this one. We'll see. Let's take a look. Hey! Yay! This came up. Hmm? Stand the probable leaderboard. Oh crap! Didn't mean to do that. No. Don't worry. It's still on. It's still on. Just don't worry. 
We're fine. We're good. We're good. We're good. I didn't. I didn't. Well, somebody did because it went off recording. Right, we're back now, folks. I'm gonna have to switch the files into two. Game, oh god, this game's horrible. Danger, oh. This is our bad. Bu we get to do the Minecraft afterwards, though, don't worry. Right, we won't look at it then. All about the desperation if you don't, if you don't like it, we won't. Look at it. No, we don't. It's not fun that night. Yeah. You want to look at it, Benji, or not? Alright. Sure sure you can't win this game anyway. Yeah, we're going to turn the sound off right now. You heartless bastard. Did you do it because you hate babies or purely to spite me? Because if it's the latter, well, I don't know what to do. It was only wooden. It wasn't real. Alright. I told you I'd be doing it. You said you wanted to look at it. I told you to do it. Besides, the baby came back at the end. Oh, hey, since my game was so awful, why don't we play someone else's game? There we go. You ready? Somebody else's game? We should be able to get into it. Yes. This seems like it'll Oh, this is the shot. same game again. No, it isn't. Trust me, this is a different one. What awesome game is it going on to now? Okay, can we keep the noise down? My microphone is very sensitive. It's okay. My it's going to hit zero. It doesn't matter. It's fine. My microphone is very sensitive, so you need to not shout like that. You press zero. I, if I press oh, zero... It's Minecraft. Is this any better? Oh Last, yes. The one thing you've always desired. A game I had absolutely nothing to do with. You can't actually control it though, guys, unfortunately, but it's pretty cool, you can we'll see Minecraft World. When I say this, I'm down making things for you. Keep on watching. From now on I will only create to fulfill a greater artistic purpose. Watch this, Stanley. I'm going to build a house. <laughs> Alright, you build a house. <laughs> this will go here. That is, no, looks like a here. crap house. Then, looks like a chair. <laughs> Let's see, what does it need? I, uh, yes, of course. And just to finish it all off. Yes. Yes. That's a rubbish it's house. I can make a better mud house than that. Go in Look at it. Gaze upon my work of art and feel ashamed at your own inadequacy. We can now. We just wait a minute. Calm down. You can't see it. Do you know the guy that was on the floor? That was him. Are you just can't? This is like the most cramped house I've ever stayed in in Minecraft. No, you can't even put a chest in. Break it. I don't think we can. Why did they build that rubbish house? Diamond. Where we need to diamond everything. Yes, yes, yes. Come along, Stanley. We have to get mine. Oh yeah, now we can go like this and I think I can't remember what happens after this. I do what? I think we can do stuff now. <laughs> We're okay, Ben. Oh. Oh. It looks like it's going to get a bit dark. Have you brought a light? No, give me a torch. Give me a torch. You're not giving me a torch, are you? You mean moderator gamer. Ow. Oh, mushrooms. Can I pick them up? No. No. They were locked. I'm gonna no, feel. No, 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 no. This is far more open-ended than I had in mind. Oh, me I'm metal. Iron, something more narrow and linear. Iron, iron. you feel utterly That's good. This will do it all. One out of five. Go No, 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 no. Couldn't save this one. Okay, new game. No. Don't worry. It, it's just, it's just, just one ending. I don't think Mini Gun, Mini Gun One doesn't like the narrator at the moment, guys. Me. He's a very big fan of Minecraft. It's loading. Again. This is like the longest ending though, so we, this is lo you sat on a bun. You sat on a bun. This is what happens when you this is what happens when you leave cake in your room. Can you remember your details for your Minecraft? Yes, but don't say Gongies. Yeah. 
Oh, yes, I can. I'm looking right now. <laughs> yes! I don't even know what this game is, but I love it. You, well, this is, you this is for everybody else, but this is the first no, we we did video we did, do, isn't it? I know, right now, too! I couldn't have done any better myself. I'm gonna try. I remember when I tried jumping into the toilet. Out. Yeah, you did. We did, yeah. We actually started jumping and tried to get in the toilet. Do you know after we recovered that you actually want to play Fortnite? Uh, could we do this after this? Yeah. yeah, I mean, we. I don't think we can. Yeah, this is actually. I hear this is my. Stand the Parable is a really good, well-made game. I'll say that because. When does this one finish? This, uh, this long. This is still the same end.